Hey guys, um, I have been uh, asked to, many people have asked me about my uh, brigantines and how they are made and what I'm looking for when I'm buying a brigantine and uh, I'm making this uh, review for All Masters. He made me a very, very, very wonderful brigantine um, and before I mudded and put on the shoulders and all the extra security that we need in our sport. Uh, I would like to show you guys what it's made of. First of all, yeah, here it is. It's made in two parts for more mobility. It's uh, this is the back. It's very uh, firm. Cover the layers. When you are a big guy like me, uh, you get hit a lot in the back because I'm I'm not that fast. So I like to have my back covered. This is a hardened spring steel, 0 0.8. Um, and here you see uh, when you have broad shoulders, you will like you you want this part of the uh, top back to be be more wide. So this covers all the way out to the um, to the shoulders. Also the back plate here. Uh, you tend to get hit a lot in the in the between the shoulders and in the back because people always like oh there's a weak spot here and this is like the hitting zone so I have a very big plate here to take all those which effectively means that I don't feel those hits so that's really nice the front plate again uh, more mobility. Uh, and the thing here is that we we I, I asked him to to I asked um, Alexei to to make this uh, out of titanium titanium because I never get hit that much in the stomach or in the chest so every all this is titanium so it it doesn't it's very light uh, so this is basically what I look for another thing I look for is how is the rivets done are they covering how do you um, feel it. You know, if you can like, if you can, you know, if you can go through here, you know, uh, if there's like top, I, I, I give it a little, you know, I scratch it, I make it a little file. And here, this is the protection for the, the grind. And this is the protection for the hips, so you don't have that trouble with putting uh, rondels and stuff like that here all the time. Okay, so, um, so far so good. Let's turn it around. So, and just around here. Again, if you look at it, I would have preferred to have two rivets, uh, but he only made one. But I, I guess I have to live with that. If it's break, I can always fix it because there's a lot of hitting here. Generally, this uh, this brigantine. It's very, very flexible, you know, you can see if I put you under the cheek, I can actually, sorry for that, it's very mobile. <laughs> so you put it under the cheek, also here you see the, the, uh, the mobility of the arms, so it's really good. Also look for when you're buying, are there, uh, is it protecting the fabric? And here you can see you put like little leather rondels in between the leather. That's really, really good. Also here. Now we go to the back. I, I would like two rivets, but that's fine. Um, all in all, you can see it's, it's a very good, very, very, very nice piece of work.